fan of the week question brought to you by the Volo Museums waiting for you on the GDS Facebook page. We're asking you, what are you dressing up as for Halloween this year? Let us know and you might score a GDS swag bag packed with goodies, including the family four pack of passes to the Volo Museum. Coming up tomorrow, we have your chance to win Tamanique's super cute <laughs> Halloween throne, okay? And so much more with Kathy Popcut. So don't miss that. We're helping you plan the perfect Halloween party plus an 80s Halloween workout with our GDS fitness expert, Tasha. One more thing before we go. Tamanique, what would you do this weekend? I had the ultimate girls weekend. <laughs> so we went to the Ice Hawks game, the first game of the season. Yeah. Had some dipping Dots. Oh my gosh. Have you been to District? Yes. They have these Southwest <laughs> egg rolls. So good. And okay. so then I was like, I don't know why. Sometimes I just feel like I have to pair it with something sweet. Yes. So then I went to the um, thing. <laughs> and then on Sunday, I, I right after church, Tina and I went to the top. I think that's what it's yes, called. Yes, at, at the, the embassy. At the suite. embassy. So good. So originally we started to order like our own stuff. And then she, the waiter was like, actually, you guys, it's cheaper if you ordered this brunch board because that's it literally has one. everything that each one of us specifically wanted on there. It was so, like, it so good. It was beautiful. That purple jam that's kind of like in the back uh -huh. amazing what's the thing amazing what is right here what? next to the blackberries the circular i think it's a chorizo sauce oh okay it was really I'm spicy curious. the bacon had jalapeno in it it was just like everything on there was like so that's their new thing they're so doing brunch on sundays up good. there yes from 10 to 3 literally go were you inside or outside we was inside okay. and then like the restaurant closed but she was like you can stay here as long as you want and so then we went outside and just like chilled outside yeah. and then we also got cold stone and went like grocery not? shopping together it was literally like the perfect girls oh, weekend well, I'm glad to hear what that. did you do oh i did some of those same things um so saturday before before the Ice Hogs game, it was another baby shower for Sierra because we're all so <laughs> excited for this baby boy that is coming soon that was at the gym. Obviously, we had a shower for her at Orange Theory. And then I also went to the Ice Hogs where I'm going to be emceeing some of the games this season. Y'all got to so go see her. JB, who of course moved to North Carolina, came back to do this a little bit and to teach me and uh, Matt how to do the shop. So <laughs> we'll see how that goes. My first actual game is this Friday night. By so, yourself? Yeah. I'm a little nervous. We'll get there. We'll get Love there. The show is nervous. <laughs> I yeah, I am nervous. And uh, yesterday, uh, I went on a five-mile walk with Tasha, who's going to be here tomorrow. <laughs> Yesterday's weather though was like was gorgeous. It was so. I mean, it and was look at gorgeous. that tree. Yes. Right. That is. That gorgeous. is such a pretty tree. What trail did y'all walk? This, we're at Midway Village. Okay. So okay. She, you know, is a more athletic, faster person than me. She wears like a 30 pound weighted vest and she just takes the to turns walk? and I follow her. So actually the fastest walking I ever do is with Tasha. So it's a legit five mile workout. And then I'm just, I had to get my Planning costume boxes. Costumes, yeah, right? my costume box under my bed and get all the pieces to see, you know, what I want to pop on uh, this week uh -huh. as we get ready for Halloween. So, Yo, you know, that's crazy. I also told you I watched Ocean's 8 for the first time. Right, she did. I, I have give it a C. Ocean, it does come over Rihanna, right? It's a girl. Yeah, so. top notch. I get out of like C plus. We hope you had, I'll tell you later. We don't have enough time. <laughs> hope you had a great weekend. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.